every person on this planet has a connection with the ocean. From the water we drink, to the fish stocks and unsustainable livelihoods it supports. But the heart of the oceans, the coral reefs, are under immense pressure from climate change, acidification, plastic pollution, trawling, and the most destructive fishing method of all, fish bombing. Fish bombing happens throughout Southeast Asia, including the Coral Triangle, the most biodiverse underwater habitat on the planet. It is illegal in every country, but until now, they've not had the means to detect it in order to enforce these laws. If fish bombing continues, people and communities will continue to lose their fisheries and future livelihoods, and the world will continue to lose some of the most beautiful, diverse, and productive habitats of all. Up until very recently, there's not been a way to know where and when fish bombing occurs. But now, Stop Fish Bombing shows where fish bombs explode immediately, in real time. By adapting proven US law enforcement technology to locate gunfire in cities, we can now report the exact time and location every time a fish bomb goes off. The boat can then be tracked by radar, drone, and video camera until it can be intercepted by law enforcement authorities. So how does it work? Acoustic sensors, hydrophones, are placed at strategic underwater locations, and the difference in arrival time of the explosion at each sensor is used by a central computer to triangulate the location. The system then reports the exact location within seconds on a mobile app. And with this very precise information, marine law enforcement authorities are alerted to take immediate action. While Stop Fish Bombing's technology is now able to locate fish bombs as they happen, more funding is needed to turn prototypes into robust systems to enable effective enforcement, to provide education and alternative ways for communities to feed their families. Everyone agrees we must stop fish bombing to save coral reefs and the livelihoods of those depending on them. Let's start now. I really want to thank you for what you're doing to use your voices, use your power, show the evidence of how terrible it is to use explosives to bomb coral reefs. We're bombing our future. We call upon all our friends, in the region and around the world to support us with technical assistance and funding to achieve SDGs 14, stopping illegal, unregulated and destructive fishing by 2020 in our waters.